Hello everybody, this is Stonewall, and today we're back with some Fortnite. It's Thursday, so week three challenges are now live. So I have completed week one and two, and something a little bit different this season is instead of every other one being a symbol for your banner, uh, every other week doesn't have a banner to find. So kind of interesting. Now I will say there was a Fort Bite, I think, in the... Uh, in the week two uh, loading screen but uh, other than that there's not really anything there so if you notice every other one is a stage one of two those are the ones where they actually give you the banners so kind of interesting all right moving on we do have the downtown drop which I have not messed with yet um, something I don't know if you're actually fighting or what it is if it's some sort of a race I, I don't even know I haven't I haven't even messed with it so we might have to look into that I've still got two of my dailies available there but here is week three so land a trick with a drift board fairly easy as long as you find one search chests at Lonely Lodge or Polar Peak again fairly easy self-explanatory deal damage to an opponent within 10 seconds after using a slipstream now the question is, does that 10 seconds start whenever you hit the ground, or whenever you exit the slipstream? Because depending on how far you have to fly to get to the ground, uh, it could be a little tricky. But in something like Team Rumble, where if the circle's near a slipstream, that might actually be pretty easy to do. Uh, visit Happy Hamlet Shifty Shafts in a single match. That's pretty easy. As you go through the stages, they get further and further apart. So what I would say is go to Happy Hamlet, get to the racetrack and pick up a baller, and ride around to Shifty. Fairly easy. Throw the flying disc toy and catch it before it lands. Now this is one of the things in the battle pass this season, and I'll show you where that is. Uh, explosive weapon eliminations. Again, if you find a uh, RPG or rocket launcher, then that should be pretty easy, especially in Team Rumble and then deal damage with different weapons in a single match. Again, Team Rumble would be really nice uh, to work that in. <clears throat> Partly because the end game you've got so many uh, supply drops dropping in, then uh, you, can, you can get new weapons pretty easily. Alright, so there is that. Now what I'm going to do is look through here and try to figure out which ones I can work on in a single match. Um, and probably jump into a Team Rumble here, uh, if it's available. Yep, Team Rumble is there. Now we also have, oh, high explosives, ha! Huh. <laughs> now that would be the easy one to get the explosive weapon kills in. Um, let's read the description here. Show off your moves in the downtown drop LTM, launch off massive jumps grind down city streets and collect coins to win so it sounds like you're on one of the hoverboards which might be nice for that first uh, landing a trick with one um, but yeah I'm gonna jump in team rumble and we'll see how this winds up All right. okay so they added the hot spots oh good grief okay I'm gonna jump and go straight to Lonely Lodge uh, to try to get chest there. They made it exactly opposite of what I needed to complete challenges here. So, But it also looks like there's a lot of people going to Lonely Lodge. So we will see how this goes. Don't know if I'll be able to get very many chests, but we're going to give it a shot. Pick up this grapple. No chest there. I'm not even hearing any chests. See, there'd normally be a chest right up there, but anyways. So, you've got these little drones flying around. There we go. 
course, dropped it for my teammate, I guess. Somebody already hit that chest over there, if there was one. So, not much in the way of chests here. Which kind of stinks. Trying to get out and see. Alright, what do we got in here? Anything of interest? Ooh, a Tommy gun. That might be nice. I do like this AR quite a bit. I've played with it some, uh, well, in several different modes. And my dog is barking again. That tends to happen a lot while I'm recording. It's worse whenever I'm streaming, I feel like. But anyways. Hey, there's another one. Oh, target. There we go. Another blue. Is that... Oh, it's a purple. Yeah, teammate probably got it from me. Yep. Good grief. I shot it down. Take a heavy over the suppressed. <clears throat> I think the heavy has less drop. Uh, I don't know why I'm just picking up all the mushrooms. But... Alright, let's see if we can get up to this. Uh, well, they might all be gone at this point. A lot of people dropped here. I didn't get a single chest. And I'm betting that most of the vehicles are going to be going from here as well. Hey, there's two ballers. Any chests in here? Yeah, chests have all been hit. Somebody just broke in the back side. I'm going to grab a baller and see if I can get around a little bit. <clears throat> now, if I find a um, hoverboard, then I'll grab that. Just to try to do a trick and land it. Going the wrong way, of course. <laughs> All right. Inside the circle now. So now let's see if we can get damage with all of the different. Uh, wow, that's kind of funny. With five different weapons in a match. Hey, a chest. <laughs> okay, get me out of here. Ooh, this is the other thing I can do. It's 
look around for enemies to drop on. So I can jump out of this the uh and land on. Somebody already got that guy. Oh. Well, that was three weapons. I don't know if that counted or not. Yep, it counted. Now I can switch out. Should be four weapons. And switch back to this one. I just need to find another weapon. Well, I've got this sniper. I'm just not very good at snipers. Everybody's trying to do that uh, damage shortly after uh, using the uh, slipstream. Which is a good mode to try to do it in, to be honest. Okay, that's a teammate doing that. Kind of flying back and forth a little bit. It's funny the difference in what you feel like is a long or a short time in a video game. It, whenever, for example, in Call of Duty, a lot of the time to kill is less than half of a second. For the most part, I mean, half of a second is a pretty slow time to kill in Call of Duty. So it's kind of kind of interesting how time works like that. Oh, is it? Come on. hurt him. Anyways. So I either need to get a hit with this uh, sniper or I need to switch it out for something else. So there's a few options down here. Oh look, another sniper. <laughs> yeah, let me grab this pistol. That ought to work. If I can't sneak up on somebody. <laughs> the fifth weapon. Yep. No problem. Pretty easy. The range on this shotgun is pretty nasty, to be honest. Ooh, thank you, teammate. Saved my butt. four kills. Let's see if I can't hit the uh... Ooh, it's all over on the other side. But there's a jump pad right here. 
So I'm gonna try to get into the uh, slipstream and see if I can't get the rest of that damage. I've done a decent amount, but not quite there yet. It's kind of funny how you can travel both directions with this. They were trying to do the same thing. Let's see if that gave me enough. Yeah, that's it. All 200. So that's at least two challenges checked off. But I don't really want to hang out near this. Hey. That's kind of funny. And that's why. <laughs> A lot of people are going to be doing that since it just came out today. Hey, we're actually winning. I don't know of anywhere around here. Wait, is what is that? Oh, it's a minigun. I was hoping for a uh, launcher. Problem is, I have no heals. gonna get this out of the way just in case that uh, drop wants to come in the wrong spot. Come on, launcher. Nope, give me that back. Yep. <laughs> Wait, that was the shotgun from 64 meters. I thought that's what he hit me with at first. That was insane. I mean, it wasn't doing much damage at that range, but good grief. The fact that it was doing any damage at that range. Whoa, what in the world? SMG. <laughs> Did a decent amount of damage there. I'm just looking for a launcher. I think they had the bow. Wait, does the bow count as an explosive weapon? Just realized that. Might be the case. Oh, get on target. Come on. Oh. Ah, how much damage did I do to them? They had to have been low. I think I shot them four times at 21 damage. Hmm. Oh, teammate stole it from me. Got him. Wow. Nice shot. Oh, it's a hunting rifle. Really? 
didn't set me down on the tree. Too bad. Was somebody there must have jumped out only two more kills to go <laughs> wow oh somebody right in front of me wait what that's funny popped up that I eliminated somebody all right not the greatest match but but I did complete some challenges. So let's see how I did. All right, got it to tier 27. Right there. So I went up what, two tiers, I believe. Now, the problem is this flying disc that you have to use for one of the missions is all the way up at 35. So I'll have to do, I might have to do some leveling to be able to unlock that. Um, I am at level 25 so hmm, I don't know might be a little bit for that we'll just have to see how that works out I haven't done the math on it yet so I did complete the deal damage with five different weapons in a single match that was pretty easy and then within 10 seconds after using a slipstream I didn't find a launcher which is what I was hoping for um, of course I don't have that unlocked yet and because of the way the map laid out, I couldn't go to Shifty Shafts or Happy Hamlet. Well, I could have, but it would have been on the enemy side. Um, and everybody dropped Lonely Lodge. And there were about three spots that I checked that normally have chests that did not. So, kind of an odd one there. I also didn't find a drift board. I did find a baller, but not a drift board. So, anyway, some of those I couldn't really do that match, but I did decent on, on getting the big ones done so that was uh, two tiers worth right there so anyways if you want to see me do more of the challenges then let me know uh, most of the time I just do a weekly video on Fortnite showing off the new challenges and trying to do multiples in a single match so hopefully you enjoy that um, yeah, if there's anything else you want to see me do, any game suggestions you have for me, uh, me and a buddy were talking a little bit last night about some of that, and I may have downloaded a uh, another game. It, apparently it's been out for a while, I just haven't touched it yet. Um, but we might give that a go at some point. Alright, so anyways, this is Stonewall signing off, and I'll see you in another video.